if a bank that is registered in Kenya established a branch or a subsidiary in Uganda and the mother bank in Kenya had a problem, would the Ugandan subsidiary be insulated against the effects of the mother bank? Not necessarily. As banks seek new markets and seek to deliver borderless services, the risks of contagious exposure increase. And this is the new nightmare faced by central banks today. This subsidiary, one could say, yes, here is a subsidiary fully capitalized. It is licensed within the jurisdi jurisdiction where it is operating. But you can never have this, this uh, subsidiary fully insulated from the problems of the parent. And the solution Kaseke and suggests is what is termed consolidated supervision. One is definitely consolidated supervision and having memoranda of understanding between the host and the home uh, country. Central banks agree to share information on a particular cross-border bank, even though this too is limited by the interest and impact the bank engenders in these different economies, leaving consolidated supervision less than foolproof. Samosetumba, NTV, Business.